Your boy Ken Spade from the 252 A Town Stand Up, watching your TV. Nigga, just stay out the way and handle your business. Every day I'm busting plays, I gotta go get it. Every time I hit my plug, we only talk tickets. These niggas be talking, but need these niggas don't live. Nigga, just stay out the way and handle your business. Every day I'm busting plays, I gotta go get it. Every time I hit my plug, we only talk tickets. I gotta go get it. Nigga, I gotta go get it. I put in work, I know you heard of me, my shit is yurt. Lacan Spady. Yep, yep. You What's good know. with it, man? Welcome to Yurt TV, my boy. Appreciate it, appreciate it, brother. Yeah, man. Uh, you, know hey, you been tuning in with Yurt TV, man? You know what we got going? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 seen, I seen the episode. Word, you know word. Saying? Respect. You know? Um, so so we we just interview uh local influential people, business owners, rappers, all that type of stuff, man. And, um, you done you done got on my radar recently, man, with some with some posts that you made. Mm -hmm. But before we get into that, let's let's start off with where you from, bro. Oh, you already know, you know. You ate him all day, D O T. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Stand up. Yeah. Always rep my city. Anywhere I go, yeah. don't even matter. You know respect, what I'm saying? Respect. We how you good. how you grow up, bro? Mom and dad. Oh, nah. You know, I grew up with my mom, brothers and sisters. Right. You know what I'm saying? Three, three of us total. Right. So I have a little brother. You know, from the projects. You know, section eight. Yeah. The worst projects in my town. You know Which what one? Op. Nah, nah, nah. New P. New even, P. even even worse because yeah. you know what's in the backyard. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. So you know. So I grew up without a dad. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. So I watched a woman take care of her business. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's why, you know, I got to apologize to the females. You know? We're going to get, we, we get, get into it. We're going to get into it. Yeah. Um, let's, yeah. let's give people an uh, idea of you, man. What, what did you do for a living, bro? Well, now, you know, I'm a, uh, I'm a pit master. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, I don't care what type of livestock it is. I cook it. You know? Okay. Always been like that. That's you what know? it is. Granddaddy had a... Hog farm, so yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Respect, like already. And you work for uh Skylight, right? Yeah, P. Yeah. Jones. Skylight, you yeah. know what I'm saying. The den, front of the den, everybody called it P. Jones. Like yeah. we know, you know, you know what I'm saying. Everybody else in the world, Skylight. So mm. respect, man. You no, know, P. Jones got a lot of racist rumors around. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying. They known for being KKK and all that good shit. How is it working for somebody like that, bro? What like to be a black man working? Yeah, with being like a black that? guy working under that type of um, regime. Yeah, I'm, I'm. I'm gonna say this right here. Yeah. Um. Since I've been there, like growing up, I knew what it was. Mm. But my thing is, for so long, I blame and judge this person for their grand, their grandparents or aunts and uncles' mistakes. Mm. So like once I stopped doing that, and I'm instead of being like, you know what? They say they the clan. Mm -hmm. We ain't fucking with them. Mm -hmm. How you, like, do, but do you know for yourself they the clan? Mm -hmm. Like, have you ever took the time out and sat down with them? Because I said, I done met plenty of racist clansmen in my life and all. Mm -hmm. And I can honestly say, me as a black man, I done sat down with a lot of people and I done made them give up their clans ways. Word. You know what I'm saying? So, not, so not, they not like, in the clan? No, 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 no. I'm not talking about with Skylight. Okay, okay. It ain't nothing like that with word, them. Word. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just saying outside of them with other people in the world. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, my thing is sometimes you can actually sit down with somebody and you listen to their views and they listen to your views. And at the end of the day, if both of y'all still feel the same way when y'all leave, that's a great respect for one another. Mm -hmm. But if one of y'all can change the other person's mind mm -hmm. to see where you're coming from, mm -hmm. that's even more power. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, that's an even greater respect. Because now it ain't about respect. Now it's love. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, So you feel love working for them? They, they oh, treat you right? Man, I ain't never, like, never in my life worked for anybody that love you and treat you as a human being. Word. Like, people say they claim now... I don't care what the granddaddy was. Like, I know who the granddaddy was. I know the, gran the granddaddy with the grand wizard, all that, dead and third. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody from this town know that. Mm -hmm. But the grandsons, they're not. Mm -hmm. like, so they're not, they not clansmen or none? Nah. Oh, word. Like, Sam, Sam is the only, Sam is the first person I knew from their family that I knew from people he grew up with to be the first person from their family to be like, nah, how y'all looking at people 
judging people by the color of their skin, that's wrong. Word. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to live like that. So off rip, he had all my respect. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, he going to treat you as a man. Mm -hmm. Or as a woman. But nothing less. Gotcha. Now, how you act and how you do after that, that that's like that's on you. Like, I ain't never had a job that be like, if you could do a job, well as you say you could do, I'll pay you what you want. Mm. So that's what they do for you. Yeah. As long as you do your job the best, they gonna give you they gonna get you right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like they, they look out for me, I look out for them. Now I ain't the type right. of person that be like, oh no, I want two thousand dollars a month or a week or all yeah. that. Hold on, I actually get more than that. But <laughs> this nigga here. Oh, 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 oh. But I mean like <laughs> You good, bro. Go ahead, bro. He's just thinking good. good. I mean, I was just saying, like yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and that ain't my only job. Yeah, but like, they, but pretty much they make sure you're right though. They they, they, they make sure that they they treat me as if I was working for my family. Mm -hmm. If if like my family had their own business mm -hmm. and I was the key to that business. That's like that that's how they treat me. They treat me that good. That's what's up. Like Thanksgiving last year. You know who I ate Thanksgiving with? I ain't, I ain't Thanksgiving with them at word. their house. Oh, word. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't ask them. I actually had to work on Thanksgiving. Mm. Ain't nobody knew. I mean, ain't nobody came up there, gave me food, or sent me a plate or none of that stuff. Not even my own people. Mm. Not even my own friends. And everybody knew I was at work. Mm -hmm. But they took the time out, came from their house, came to work, told me, you know what, stop what you're doing. Don't even worry about it. Come on with us. Dirt, dirty and all. I'm like, let me go home, change clothes. Nah, let, nah. get in the car. Mm -hmm. So what would you say to people that, that call you like a bootlicker or some shit like that? <laughs> <laughs> you oh, know, I, 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 know I know you done hurt. I know you done hurt. House nigga, bootlicker. Well, Uncle Sam at, uh, uh, Uncle, Uncle Tom, Tom at, yeah, yeah, nah, yeah. first of all, if you're going to call me. Uncle uh, Ruckus uncle, too. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. just heard Uncle Ruckus recently. Yeah. Well, well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. If I'm <laughs> Uncle Ruckus and all that stuff yeah. right there, let, let's at least make it correct. Okay. Like, like this the modern day age. Yeah, yeah. I'm an Uncle Ken ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like the fuck? Like if you like if you want to be correct about it, like put my name in it. Cause, cause, cause it's 2020, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Put my name in it. You know what I'm saying? That's the good like, thing. motherfucker wanna talk about something. Oh, he's old. Oh, oh, he kissed, be kissed, clan ass and all this. Yeah, yeah, what? Yeah, I heard it. If put like this. Yeah. If they the clan, mm -hmm. All black people need to fuck with clan people. <laughs> Come on, Because, Ken. be honest, Where? I ain't never had them ever call me out my name, all this, dead and the third. Word. Like, when I needed money or I couldn't pay, like, my bills or something like that. And yeah. remind you, like, I'm a black man. I'm a fella. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, my mom and dad, they keep me out at 13 just just because to show me you want to act, you want to run these streets and act like you a man? Oh, you got to see what a man is mm. at, at an early age. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of stuff people are doing now, mm -hmm. I was doing that 14, 15, 16. Mm -hmm. Like, I've been the plug in my city mm -hmm. as a teenager. Mm -hmm. Like, but I changed all that. Mm -hmm. Like, I, that's why I be trying to tell people, like, you looking at a guy who joined the military, the youngest person in his town and in his and in the county at that time, 17 years old, joined the military. Like, I graduated from the military before I graduated from high school. Mm -hmm. And I ain't never failed no grade. Mm -hmm. So the same time while I was reading books, I was learning how to kill too. Mm -hmm. And remind you, I'm from the streets. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And like... Now I remember you, bro. We used to fight. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, even me and you, like me and yeah. you done had our beef fact, fights fact. and all that. That's and my, right. my thing like this, all these people want to act hard and this, that, and third. My thing like this, have you really been like that your whole life? That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, as a child growing up, can nah, everybody nah, we definitely really... used to give like, it up, bro. You, you, you know what I'm saying? used to give it up no matter what, bro. <laughs> like, he didn't give a fuck. I, nah, I, get, I can vouch and like, say that. He didn't give a fuck, bro. We used to throw hands every time like, we seen like each other, Like, you feel me like anywhere. Yeah. I don't care. Yeah, like, yeah. man... It could be a thousand cops around, mm -hmm. and I see you. If I want you, I'm going to eat you. Mm -hmm. and I'm going to eat the police, too. You know what I'm saying? Because to be honest, yeah. like, you can ask people in my city when yeah. you think about it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody in my age group got more assaults on the government official than I do. Oh, like, word. the police know I will put my hands on them. Word. And the police know that if when it comes down to dealing with me, I'm going to make you do your job. Mm. You know what I'm saying? No. Now, I ain't, I ain't really too stupid with it. Because yeah, yeah. I'm the type of motherfucker, if I see a gun in your hand, yeah. okay, all right, you got, you got it. You got it. Yeah, yeah. But if that gun in a holster, mm -hmm. oh, now I got you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, 
Like, <laughs> now, now, now I got you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, eat them up, bro. Who? Man, I don't care who you is. Like, 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 real shit, I look at myself as a modern day Malcolm X, Malcolm X and Martin Luther King. Mm. You put your hands on me. Mm-hmm. I don't care what color you is. White, black, purple, or blue. Mm-hmm. I'm going to hurt you or I'm going to kill you. Mm-hmm. And I ain't just going to fuck with you. I'm going to do you and your family. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what the society I grew up in made me ask. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the hardship. Remind you, I mean, I grew up in the harsher conditions of any black man could have been in. Mm-hmm. In the most racist town or city in their state. Fact. And that's a feeling. And I'm winning. Mm-hmm. And I ain't got to sell drugs, kick down nobody's door. No, all I got to do is wake up every morning and carry my black ass to work. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, so a lot of my posts is, like, I don't sugarcoat shit. I never sugarcoat shit in my life. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and I'm never going to. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would raise ass. If you say something. Stand on it. Stand on it. Right. Say it. But at the end of the day, make sure you take that punishment that you did as a man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like. So 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 some I seen when you uh, got into it on Facebook yesterday, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, you just calling people that you knew famous from the city, from from Aiden Town. Yeah, my 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 thing my thing this right here, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I left a lot of people out. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? But my my thing is, as a person that came from the condition I came from, mm-hmm. like because to be honest, if you want to say somebody that I left out and I thought of. Off real. Who was name, Quin- name, what, name the people you said at first. What was Quincy Jump? But name uh, name all the people you I mean, said uh, on the post. Quincy Clark. Uh, I yeah, said okay. well, Mr. James. Yeah. And who's Mr. James? The uh, work yeah, there. Mr. James is the pit man. The he's like if I had to put it in a cat category, he's like Ip Man of barbecue. Like Ip Man. Ip Man of man. barbecue. Yeah. Like he been like he's known worldwide. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Word. And my thing is, he known worldwide from when black people really had to be scared. Mm-hmm. Like, during the racist, racist time. Mm-hmm. Where guess. where you can see Klan marches walking up and down the street every, every fucking day. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was famous then. I got you. You know what I'm saying? And still is now. Mm-hmm. You said Mr. James. Uh, Mr. James... You know what I'm saying? My cousin Fonzie, you know what I'm saying? Osama, you Shout know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, my cousin Glenwood, Shout you know what I'm saying? Shout yeah. out, you know, like, like my boy Big E, you know what I'm saying? Shout like, Big. much respect from him, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And out of, and me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and like, out of all of us, all of us done seen the good and bad and even try to help our hood out. Mm-hmm. My thing, like, it's a lot of people that I left out, but my thing is this. These are people around my age group. Mm-hmm. Mr. Jane, I just threw him in there because, like, like that's my guru. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But these these people around my age group that I I know, I watched how they came up. Mm-hmm. Or, or I seen the struggle or know they went through some type of struggle like I did. That's you right. know what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, even though they made it, they made sure they came back and showed love to their hood. Mm-hmm. Not made it and went out. Because I know too many people be repping. Other other hoods and they not from that hood. Mm-hmm. Like, nah, you from this hood. Why you rapping that hood? Mm-hmm. Like, oh, but because you live there now, you gotta rep there. Mm-hmm. So stuff like that, I, I can respect that, but I can't respect that. You know what I'm saying? Because you're not being you. You had to change who you are as a person to be somebody else. Mm-hmm. Like, like that's 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 not you. I'm not gonna change who I am. I'm sorry. Like I might change a little bit, I bend a little bit, but at the end of the day, like I am who I am. Like, you you talking to a person that had the one person in his life, like my grandma. You know what I'm saying? Like, I watched my grandma die in my arms. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, knowing when my grandma die, I'm homeless. Because as me being kicked out of my mom and dad's house as an early, early teenager, I can't go back home. Mm. You know what I'm saying? My fat, my pride won't let me. Like, my biggest downfall in life was my pride. You know what I'm saying? I had to learn how to sometimes you got to give in to your pride. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, if you're giving in to that pride, is you getting anything out of that? Mm-hmm. If you break, if you, like, if you give up your pride, like, what are you really getting out of that? But check this out. Some, some people in the, in the town of Aiden look at you as like, you, 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 you don't fuck with black people. You don't ride with black people like that. Yo, they, nah, they, nah. They, you know what I'm saying? Because you're shorty white. 
you know, say you work for white people and then you always talking crazy on Facebook. This is what I'm seeing though. So that's why I'm asking. Nah, nah, so, nah. First so, of all, let's go. I'm going to be honest. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, me and my shorty just got into it because I got caught up fucking with a black girl. Mm. Damn, you going to put that on your... I'm, I mean, I'm being, I'm being me. I'm being honest, Mike. Respect, respect. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I'm a man. I'm going to be honest. Yeah. If I fuck up, I'm mad enough to say I fuck up and take whatever bullet like that I got to chew after that shit. Respect. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, that's, that's a man. You know what I'm saying? Like that, like that's what my, my my stepdad is. You know what I'm saying? Like I used to hate, I used to hate my stepdad just because he was my stepdad and not my real dad. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Even though he was showing me all the right ways to be a real man, I didn't want to listen because I'm like, you're not my daddy. I ain't gotta listen to you. But my real my real daddy, I never met him a day in my life. Mm. I talked on to him more on the phone than I had ever seen him in real life. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But as I got older. I had to learn the only thing my stepdad was teaching me is how to be a man. Mm. Like, I ain't think about it. This man had his own kids and he married my mama when she already had three other kids. Mm. And took care of all of us. Mm. Put food on the table for all of us. Make sure we ate every night. Make sure we had clothes on our back. Word. Like. So what do you say to those people? Like. The people pe- that say that, that say that you, you don't like black people, you don't fuck with black people. No, my, my, like, my thing is this right here. I fuck with black people every day. Mm-hmm. I just don't like fucking with niggas. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What's like, the difference in the black person and the nigga? Yeah, that, that, there's a big difference. What's the difference? You know what I'm saying? Like, if being in the hood every day, all day, or standing on the block every day, all day is okay with you, mm. I don't want to be around you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Waking up every morning, not trying to get no money, mm-hmm. or trying to live off another female, mm-hmm. or this, that, and third. I don't want to be a run. Mm-hmm. That shit like COVID to me. <laughs> like, the fuck? Well, you hello, everybody. <laughs> and my thing is, everybody that know me know I've been like this my whole life. Nah, so, facts, my, yeah. my thing is, I don't know why people are so shocked when I say shit on social media, Facebook, or yeah, whatever. Yeah. Like, I'm about to open up my Instagram yeah. and all that stuff again, yeah. because... I had to shut all that stuff down because I just got tired of hearing people dumb ass whining and complaining. Yeah. Like, people, like, even with the Floyd stuff, mm-hmm. like, y'all will go do all these marches. Now, don't get me wrong, I wanted to march, mm-hmm. but at the end of the day, I'm like, hell, police be, used to whoop my ass all the fucking time. Mm-hmm. You know how many times I done got beat up by the fucking police? Mm-hmm. And, like, people know this. I ain't see y'all motherfucker marching or, you know what I'm saying, like rallying for me. The fuck? But you want me to go do this for a person that I don't know? Yeah, yeah. Now, I'm sorry for the fact of, like, what happened and how it happened. Like, like as a black person, my, I don't even care as a person to nobody should be treated like that. In fact. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But my thing is, like, don't try to be a march or be a part of something just so you could get some height or fame so somebody can see you. That's, that's, that's why I fell back. I seen a lot of people right, doing that. Right. And I'm, and, like, and, I'm not with that. And, you know what I'm saying? And see, that ain't, that and ain't see when I already know that ahead right. of time, yeah. I'm not going to be with it. Yeah. Just like we are there at the job with the whole, like, everybody that was at the job that night when that whole video came out, when we were talking about, oh, the clan is here, the clan is here, they rallying up. Yeah. I'm like, you dumbass motherfucker, you see my car up there. Mm. And for you to know, and for everybody to know how I am, I'd be the first motherfucker to put their ass on live. If it, if, if it was really like that. If the clan was at the... Yeah, the you know what I'm saying? But they not like that. I ain't seen... Man, them people don't do nothing but show straight love to black people. Like, right. I watch these... I, like, I watch... I watch Skylight give more free food to black people mm. than they do to white people. Word. I don't watch them people coming up there saying, oh, they can't pay their rent or or light bill or 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 they need to put food on the table, something like that, and they give them the money. Mm-hmm. And I'm talking about these people I grew up with. Mm-hmm. And I'm talking about these, their mama and daddy and uncles and stuff. Like, I'm literally watching them. I work outside. Mm-hmm. So I'm watching this. That's right. And sometimes they tell them, oh, you ain't got to pay it back. It's <clears throat> okay. You're good. And a lot of times they be like, all right, just pay me whenever you get it. You know what I'm saying? But then turn around and their kids or somebody real close in their family want to talk shit about them. Mm. But as you as adult, don't put them in a place. Mm. Like, nah. People talking about burning the place down. People got mad because I said, if you know me, 
you know. If you come out here to my job with that bullshit, you know I'm a hog slap the shit out of you. You know what I'm saying? Like. They better not burn it while you were there. Who? Hell no! <laughs> the fuck? Motherfucker, what? Because hey, if I survive, I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna come out. I'm gonna kill. Look, you're dealing with a person. I kill. I ain't gonna just kill you. Because you're gonna get the same amount of time as one body as you do for 10. Yeah. When I kill you, I'm gonna kill you, your mom and your daddy, and any close kin of you. Because at the end of the day, before I let your family retaliate for me fucking your ass up, yeah. I'm gonna wipe all of them out. Mm, that's gangster. That's definitely gangster. Because before you sit here and give me 30 years or 50 years, nigga, you gonna give me the goddamn needle. Mm. I'm not, I'm, you're not about to have me in a cage like a fucking animal that goddamn wrong. I can't do it. I ain't gonna lie. I can't do it. I feel you. Like, when I kill one person, I'm gonna kill everybody. Yeah. Like, all witnesses and all, kids and all, I'm, I'm sorry. Like, I don't leave no witnesses. The fuck? That's it, crazy. You ain't, you ain't about to point me out. I'm, I'm just being honest. Like, 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 that's, like, that's how I was, like, that's what the society Raise me ass. You know what I'm saying? So, so to be it, on guard. You got and on some shield, allegations I'm, out there, like you put the police on a couple guys. Is that fact or fiction? My thing like this: How I put the police on you mm -hmm. when you already the police? Mm. And can't none of them say that? Say I'm lying. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So at so the what end, you mean of, by so, it? they they telling is what you are saying? No, my thing. They been telling. Mm. So they telling the police. Oh. They they been they been told. Word. Like I'm talking about when I know somebody that's fucking a police officer. Fucking one. I mean not now, okay. but this was like back then during the time and all that. Yeah, yeah. Like and I'm hearing the conversations they having. Mm. And they come around and saying like, oh, this nigga right here, or see the police ride by, or some shit, be like, look at that bitch ass motherfucking cop, like, look at that pig, all this damn there. Mm -hmm. He was like, a lot of them can't even say what they want to say because they putting their job in jeopardy. Mm -hmm. Like, hey, you call me a pig trying to stand in front of your boys? Yeah. Bro, you just, you just came to me and told on two niggas. What? Like, I know, like, too many, too many people I watched and seen them get sale charged and drug charged gun charge and all they do is county time and come home <laughs> that's tough right there that's tough that's like, tough hey that's i'm being tough. i'm being hey that's hey, tough right hey, there. I'm being, hey i'm being honest and real my that's, that's nigga. Tough. like for real that's and tough. like when you the victim see see the thing is this right here mm -hmm. when you a victim of a crime mm -hmm. and you tell when, I'm talking about when I say a victim, I mean you about to die. Mm. Like, or you getting shot, some shit like that. Mm. How you, how does police shit? When at the end of the day. Well, you know, police, I, when, niggas call anybody snitch these days, but uh, snitching, uh, exactly. snitching these days is any contact with the my, police whatsoever. My, my thing is this right here. When a nigga that shot me already told the police everything that's going on, mm. and gave y'all up too. Why the hell did I did more time and went to jail and went to prison and all y'all did was county time? Mm. Mm. That's 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 wild right there. That's a question for the streets. Like, like but that's a question for but, the streets, right? But there. all of them that cause like and it really ain't all of them. It's like two, three people. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? In one situation. But at the end of the day, can't none of them say I came to them as a man and told them straight up. Like my nigga, you ain't got to worry about shit. Before I take the stand on you, I go do that time. And that's what I did. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But they won't come out and say that, though. Mm -hmm. They won't say that. Word. But at the end of the day, you got you did a felony crime, but you got probation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do that, though. No, 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 no. But my, 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 thing, my thing is this right a here. A shooting? Huh? A shooting or a drug? Yeah, shoot, both. My fit both. They got both. <laughs> Multiple. You know what I'm saying? Like, how many times they gonna give you probation? Like, <laughs> shit. Like, you ain't gotta do no no prison time. You gotta do nothing. That's crazy. Like, I got I got caught with a little bit of fucking cocaine, mm -hmm. and they sent me away. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about straight to the yard. Did you have a lawyer? Huh? Yeah, I had a lawyer. To pay for or court court appointment? At the time, it was court appointment. Oh nah, you ain't gonna go to. But they definitely send you. But away. at the end of the day, yeah, they taught me. The system already set up to Thanks. bring black people down. Of course. You know what I'm saying? But also, 
I had other pending charges of doing dumb shit like high speed chases, mm. like fighting the police. Mm. Like I had all I had all that other stuff. They just combined it all together if I just take this charge right here. Mm. So I said, well fuck it, since I'm the victim too, you know what? I done told them they like, you know what, bruh, y'all ain't got to worry about. Since I did fucked up, semi kinda, even though I'm the victim, I said, bruh, don't even worry about it. You ain't even gotta do no time, I'm gonna do time. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like So you ain't tell on nobody? Nah. Okay. And that, and that's my thing. How how I tell on how I tell on you if I ain't take the stand. Mm. And at the end of the day, if I go to you off rip and be like, bruh, you ain't even got to worry about it. Like, them niggas like that respect me as a man. That's why at the end of the day, all of them, all of these people like all the ones that try to say, Oh, I told, why are you still hanging around me? Mm. Why are you still dapping me up? Mm. You know what I'm saying? Why 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 why, why you come like in my house or chill or play cards or ask me for a ride or this, that, and third. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, just in the incident with a nigga, Carlo, try to, like, do all that, like, try to get famous on Facebook off of me, bro. You know what I'm saying? Mm. But, bro, I just caught you at the block and you ain't want to do nothing. Mm. By yourself, really. My fact, you had two other, two other niggas with you. You know what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, they doing more talking than you. But it's but it's a beef between me and you. Because at the end of the day, I ain't no Facebook gangster. Like whatever I say on Facebook or whatever, I I am what I am. But at the end of the day, can't nobody ever say I ever ran from nowhere. So so who was the sex slave you were talking about, bro? <laughs> <laughs> this nigga, you done posted on the book talking about some man. You, you snapped on somebody. I don't know who you were talking about. Nobody know who you were talking about, but somebody somebody pissed oh. you off, bro. We, oh shit! Oh, you gotta say a name. Oh, man. They, oh, they know. They know. They know. Word. Shorty was really a sex slave, man. She tried to play you now. It was too long. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro. I had to cut them both off. Cause one jumped out of line. I wasn't even talking about her, mm. and she thought I was talking about her. Yeah. But my thing is this right here. I'm the type of man that before I disrespect my woman in a way that. I wouldn't do a person that's on my side. Mm -hmm. I'd rather do it to somebody else. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But be man enough to come back and let her know. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, or be honest if she asks. That's like that's that's the type of man I am. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I fucked up, I fucked up. Mm -hmm. I'ma tell you I fucked up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, like, I'ma do what I gotta do as a man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like. People try to act like, oh, can you ball? Like, you acting like you balling. Like, you got a hundred bands, all this You were talking stuff. crazy on the book, though, bro. You said niggas couldn't even buy your cheapest car. <laughs> well, yeah. And well, I'm being well. honest, bro. <laughs> and I'm being honest. Because I don't. Because well, you I talking done, about your ops, or you just talking about niggas that ain't? Like, no, no, nah, nah, I'm talking about, like, the niggas that's hating. Mm. That's actually trying to come at me when I'm like, bro, you riding around in a, a Hyundai, a, 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 a Toyota, something. <laughs> Like I don't I ain't, I don't know what a uh I don't even know what a payment is, bro. Word. Like all my cars I bought straight cash. Mm. Cash money. Like J Dub and Kiara tell you, I woke up I woke up the dealer, the owner of the dealer out of his sleep mm. at eleven o'clock at night mm -hmm. to buy a car. Damn. Straight cash money. Mm. Money you, talk bullshit walk. What you buy? The BMW 745 LI. Mm. Shit, no. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just because one of my other cars was just in an accident that morning. Mm. I ain't got to go get runners. Mm. I got multiple cars. But then again, since when people found out that car got into an accident that morning, I heard somebody, I heard two or three people like, oh, oh, oh. The, the Benz fucked up. The E five hundred fucked up. It's yeah. red. You know what I'm saying? What you about to go get now? A little putt putt, a little toot toot. Yeah. Nah, man. <laughs> the, the damn hoo hoo. You know what I'm saying? Like go even harder, man. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, because yeah. that's because like that's that, that's like that's that's what I do. Yeah. I'm never gonna let nobody hold me back. Period. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like when when I take off, I'm I'm taking off and I'll keep going. Mm. Now I might slow up a little bit, but I ain't never turning back around again. Mm. You know what I'm saying? When my grandma died in my arm, when my grandma died in my arm, my nigga, like I was, that, that's that, that's a hard pill to swallow, bro. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, so it pissed me off when people try to tell me about pain. I'm like, you can't tell me about pain if you ain't never had a loved one die in your arm. Mm -hmm. 
You know what I'm saying? You can't tell me about pain if you ain't ever been homeless. You know what I'm saying? That's a super like, fact. Because I, cause I got hit with both of them on the same night. Mm. You know what I'm saying? On the same night. You know what I'm saying? And the whole time, majority, after that time, the only people really helped me out was white people. You know what I'm saying? While I watch black people from my hood just laugh and shit on me. Mm-hmm. Oh, can down, he fucked up, or oh, blah, blah, blah. I, I, I'm, I'm lost right now. Mm-hmm. But then when I found myself, I just took off. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I'm the type of person, I ain't got to go out and steal. Mm-hmm. I ain't got to do nothing to my black people at all. In no type of harmful way at all. Mm-hmm. Because I was raised and taught as a man. You got to go get it. You got to go sacrifice yourself. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to be 60, 70 years old, still got to sell drugs. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to be able to sit home and, and get a retirement check with the uh, picket fence with the 40, 50 acres. Mm-hmm. Like, like that, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm working toward. Mm-hmm. I want my 40 acres and three horses with, with some Akitas. <laughs> already got the Akitas. You know what I'm saying? You already got the Akitas. Yeah, two Akitas. <laughs> Japanese Akitas. You know what I'm saying? Like... Like, 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 that's what I, like, that's, like, that's my type of mind frame. Respect, respect. Like, I want to be the person to where at the end of the day, at, when, at the end of the day, when, when, when I'm a granddaddy, like, God willing that I can see that day when I'm a granddaddy, like, my grandkids could be like, Papa, I'm like, what up, baby? Or what up, son? <laughs> Daddy said you from the hood. Mm-hmm. What's the hood? Mm-hmm. Like real shit, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to do that good for my family, so my family ain't never got to go back there. That's you know right. what I'm saying? And not just my immediate family. I want all my family like that. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm a type of person. If I see you trying to do good, I'ma help you. You know what I'm saying? But if I see all you want to do is just suck the life out of something, mm-hmm. oh, I'm gonna get the hell away from you and cut you off. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? This whole time during coronavirus, you know why a whole lot of older people and all of them still respect me? Well, that. Because I'm a type of person, I actually will pay your light bill. Mm-hmm. I will actually will help pay your rent. I will actually will if you tell me your baby daddy ain't shit and I already know most motherfuckers ain't shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, your kids need some shoes or something, I give it to you. And not go, have to go on the book and not and, put it on Facebook. And, and, put, and, put it, and go on the book and put them on blast when yeah. I get mad at them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people that come at me, I done, did, I done did shit for them and their family. And I'm like, boy, I could get real disrespectful and be like, well, since you talking shit like that, why don't you go ahead and pay me back that money I gave you to pay your rent? Or, or 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 the money I gave your mom and dad to pay that card that car note because they ill about to get seized. Mm. Like, since you want to talk shit and, and put people on blast, but you said you balling, though, right? You on Section 8 and you balling? Like, I don't care if you on Section 8 and you got a, and you got a fucking Ferrari. That's, that shit don't impress me. Mm. That shit don't impress me. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, why you on Section 8 if you could buy a Ferrari? Mm. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? I'm the type of black man, I'd be damned if I'd be in the projects and be driving a foreign car and living in the projects. Nah, I'm going to get out of the projects, get a crib, and then buy my phone. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, I got to make sure I'm able to stand on my own two feet as a man before I try to act like I'm a fucking goat. Well, I'm hearing all the people saying they goats and stuff. I'm yeah, like, that's what made you mad right there. Like, it pissed that me. That shit done pissed you off. That's what got you lit on the book last night. <laughs> Somebody oh. said his name was a goat somewhere. Like, that shit done changed his own perspective. Boy, you a goat. Okay. Yeah. Bro, I, be drink, I drink champagne every day like water. <laughs> and I ain't got to steal shit. Hey, yo, I ain't got to sell drugs. Yeah, bro. Hey, and, 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 people that, and people that be around me every day and all that stuff, yeah. they'll take it and like, yo, that nigga ain't lying, bro. Mm. That nigga ain't lying. Yeah. I have a car game and give everybody champagne. <laughs> it's lit like that, man. That's what's up. Bro. Lit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like. That's what's up. And I ain't, and I don't get no first of the month retarded check, crazy <laughs> check, uh, yeah. uh, 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 disabilities check, yeah, yeah. like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga crazy. Yeah. Hey, I mean, all, all facts, all facts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, 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 that's, that's, that's me. Yeah, I'm gonna hit you with all facts. Yeah, yeah, you know facts, what I'm saying? Man. And because at the end of the day, anything I ever did wrong, I done took the maximum, the maximum punishment for that mm. of everything. 
from each individual person or every different event. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So what what would you um want want out of it? Like what's your best what's your what you think um Aiden guys should do? You know what I'm saying? Like my, for, for for like the best interests of Aiden. My my How my, you think my this thing come up. My my thing is this: o open your eyes. Like mm. stop being on the bandwagon. Mm. Like. I wish I would have started working for Skylight a long time ago. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, the whole time I never worked for them, even though I knew I knew how to do the job they want me to do. Yeah. The whole time I never worked for them is because I'm listening to what everybody else say. Oh, they the clan, this, that, and third, blah, blah, blah. You know what? I just had made it up in my mind one day. I'm like, you know, I'm going to go find out for my goddamn self. Facts. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what a lot of people don't do. A lot of people don't go find out their own self. Or a lot of people were scared to fall, so they'll stay where they at because they feel like it's good. Word. Like, I didn't just leave the hood and come back. I mean, I didn't just leave the hood and stay away. I left the hood, went away, and came back. Came back to my town because my grandma was doing back. You know what I'm saying? And I'm blessed and I'm happy that I did that. Just to get the little bit of time I did have left with her. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that day when we were talking before she died, she told me, she was like, baby, I'm glad I lived long enough to see you change. Mm. That's what's up, bro. That's that's why that's why a lot of things still out here trying to survive, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? I've been... I been the robber guy, you know what I'm saying? I ain't really been no no no. When I did steal, I just stole from family members. <laughs> like I'm gonna be honest, and that was like as a child, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. That's one of the reasons why I got kicked out. They were y'all that done that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But at these so-called gangsters, <laughs> I don't I don't steal from regular old black people that's working for it mm. or stuff like that. And when I did all that stealing, I was in a teenager. Like, my thing is, what a lot of people doing now, I was doing when I was in the teens. I'm 30 now. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I went to prison, came out, had nothing. And less than five years, get three cars, own crib, paying own bills. Got a farm pet. My fact... I don't even know nobody with no Akita. I want to see that shit, bro. No, go, ahead, go ahead, grab it for now. Yeah. Fuck. I want to see that shit. I ain't seen that. You seen Wait, that shit? Uh, yeah. Y'all seen it? Yeah. You seen it? I want to see that shit, bro. He said he got two of them. Yeah. Come on. That ain't a big Look at that motherfucker, boy. That shit pretty as hell. Yeah. Zam, come on. Yeah, she pretty as hell. Hold on, that's the baby. Look, and she ain't, she, ain't, she ain't even three. That's the little one. Yeah, you only got three of them. Keep two here. That's why I tell people, I don't need no gun. I ain't, I ain't gonna criminate myself and say I ain't got one. Oh, I do got one. Mulan. <laughs> Fact. All I'm saying is, come break into my shit you want to. Oh, I got some shit that eat people. You got some shit that eat people. They, they, like, and they, they, they. Hey, them things are not no joke. Mm. Like, I used to take them bear hunting. What's some encouraging words, man? You can get to the youth that's watching this, my, man. My, my, um, my thing is, yeah. like, with the youth, never let nobody tell you what you can't do. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, you you got to, like, even now, as a grown man, I'm still got to learn how to control my temper and, mm -hmm. you know, my, and my anger and all this, that, and the third. But I'm like, if you know my past and you know what I went through, like, you understand my anger. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, like, for one, just, like, if you got to be in the streets, I understand being in the streets. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But also, at the end of the day, try to do better. Like, try to do better than what your parents doing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, because at the end of the day, the biggest downfall for black people, we don't never try to do better than what our parents are doing. Mm -hmm. So when we're not doing better, that means we're not going nowhere and we're going back down. Mm -hmm. So... That's why a lot of people, and then they want to say, put it through the black and white game. Like, black, first of all, I can't tell you nothing about slavery. I, I wasn't born during slavery time. Can't tell you nothing about uh, segregated and all that. I wasn't born during that time. Mm -hmm. I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing about none of that. Mm -hmm. 
All the hard shit that all our people went through and all that, I don't know nothing about none of that. Because I personally didn't go through it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But one thing I'm going to do for all my people that went through that, I done learned to take all that anger that they had and you try to be the best motherfucker you could be. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, whatever you good at or what you do, you like, you do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I don't care what it is. Whatever it is to do, do that. And keep and stay in school. Hmm. Like, I don't care if you a sports star or whatever, this, that, and third. At the end of the day, I don't care how nice you is in any type of sport. If you get hurt, what you got for you? It's over. It's over. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you ain't got no brain. Hmm. Because you ain't trying to go to school. You ain't trying to better educate yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, all these, like, NBA young boy, all that, all them like that. Like I, I listen to that music. I like it, mm -hmm. but I don't pay that shit no mind because they, them boys hot. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like they, they, they trying to floss and be hot for the hood. Mm -hmm. Nah, how about try to help people come out the hood? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like so, at the end of the day, there is no hood. Like what, what is the hood? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't never heard anybody say that before. Like you, you like you feel me, like, and I and, and, and that's the type of person I am. That, yeah. Like that's the type of my level and stuff. I'm on like that. You know what I'm saying? Respect. And I learned all that through like all my struggles. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like so, if a person mad at me because I'm I'm saying I'm winning, and they mad, you gotta be the most pathetic, miserable motherfucker in the world. <laughs> like my thing is like. That's how I know you probably didn't go to school all the way. <laughs> or didn't graduate all day. Yeah. Because a smart motherfucker would have been like, because even me, I've done business with my enemies. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, I don't care if we enemy or we friend. Business, business. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, if it's a way that I could progress or move <laughs> forward in life, like, that's like, that's, that's, that's. That, that's real that's real human being stuff Facts. you know what I'm saying for you to be able to put whatever bullshit you got to the side mm -hmm. to make both of y'all succeed mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying like when you could do that you'll end up realizing like I forgot why I was mad at you anyway mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying like instead of hating on somebody why don't you just ask them what they got to do to succeed you know what I'm saying yeah cause I don't never remember like, us being cool bro nah I don't nah, never remember like, us every being time, cool. like, every like every time every time we see each other we used, to, up, we used to fight you yeah, know what I'm saying yeah, yeah, like yeah. every single time that's and that's and that's my thing is like I was always that reckless little kid mm -hmm. like I was always that kid oh you could get him 20 or 30 dollars to fight anybody, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> or to go steal off on anybody. Like I was that little kid. Yeah. Like I, I don't know how to run. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because I will always talk, take everything head first. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. anything you do, like you gotta eat that. Like you gotta soak all that up, and you gotta eat that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, don't never turn around and go back. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like even if you do turn around and go back, you go back and visit, and you keep your ass keep going. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And when you visit. Try to drop some knowledge off or help a few people here and there so you can try to help them come out too. You know what I'm saying? Right. But a lot of people ain't, ain't like that. You no, know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Like, so I'm like, when I see people stunning, and it pisses me off when I see people stunning and they owe me money. <laughs> like, that's the real thing that be pissing me off. Yeah. Like, cause it be too many people that be calling themselves goats and stuff. Like, I ain't trying to say I'm a boss or none of that stuff. Like, well, no, excuse me. I am a boss. Like, I'm a boss ass nigga now. Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, sure. Like, I ain't no king or nothing like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just saying I'm a boss. You ain't the king of king Aiden, bro. No, nah, no, nah, I ain't the king of nah. Aiden. <laughs> All my fact, even if, even if I could have been the king of uh, Aiden. Nah, or, you, we already said. Yeah, Pete yeah. Jones king of Aiden yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Skylight run Aiden now. Yeah. Don't, don't get it twisted now. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And that would piss me off, like, you got people all around the world, all different religions, races, and everything, come to North Carolina, to this small-ass town, Ada, just to eat barbecue. That you chop up? No, I don't chop. Oh, you don't chop? What'd you do? I cook. Oh, you cook? Oh. By myself. Yeah. Pit master. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, all of them. Yeah. All the hogs. How many of you, how many, how many hogs you done chopped in one day? What's the most? Uh, I don't cook in one day. All totals for the whole that day and the next day, about 15, 16, mm. by myself at one time. Word. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how much I want success. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know most people can't even stand in a fire pit with me 
for five, ten minutes without them complaining they hot or it's too hot. I be in there for 12 hours or better. You know what I'm saying? Like, because at the end of the day, I'd rather bust my ass every fucking day and as hard as I can to get what I want in life instead of me having to steal for it and think I accomplished something. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Or instead of for me having to take it from somebody and think and think, oh, I oh I got oh I got this on my own. You ain't get on your own if you ain't work for it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like I done seen the lifestyle of that I don't the same way I'm living now, I've been living like this like for a while. Mm-hmm. Like it ain't no time in my life growing up that anybody could be like, oh Ken, that's a broke ass nigga. Mm-hmm. No. I had one time in life somebody called me a broke ass nigga and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make sure a motherfucker ain't gonna never call me that again. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, never. Mm-hmm. Now I might I might not be I might not be rich or whatever, mm-hmm. but I ain't gonna be broke. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna have my own shit, pay my own bills, like you know what I'm saying? Like feel, what like like what men shit do. Like what what I what people I really don't men these like Males these days, especially black men, they don't, they not own that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like they living off a of female. You know what I'm saying? And as a man, how can you look at yourself as a man and you living off a of female? But you know it's tough though. It's tough for niggas too though. I my, gotta speak up for niggas, bro. My, my, it's no, tough, bro. My, like first niggas of be all, coming home from prison sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Me, niggas, be, niggas be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? My, my thing is, I yeah. got all this stuff less than five years, and I came home from prison, mm-hmm. and I came home homeless. True. Without nothing but like twenty dollars in my pocket. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Homeless for a week and a half. But guess what? I beat that bullet. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Did nobody know I was homeless. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? They just thought I was just gone. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Respect. But at the end of the day, even when you even at my downest time, I never grieved for it. You know what I'm saying? Like I never been like, oh, when I'm down, oh man, I'm down. Oh, I'm down. Nah. You know what I'm saying? I just be like, damn. Gotta get well. Got to get back. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Hell, I seen worse days. Like, shit. I still got a house. Pay my own bill. Forms. I got more foreign cards than I got Americans. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, and pay cash for all of them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I could go in there and show you all the titles. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I ain't had to steal none of that. You know what I'm saying? So, even at your downest time, like, remember that you... Still could be better than somebody else. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So just think even at your worst time, think, hell, it could have been even worse. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And just be like, bounce back off that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like from that. And just keep pushing forward. Like I love it when people tell me, oh, I can't do this, or I can't do that, or you can't have this, or you can't have that. That's why I bought the Mercedes and the BMWs. Like, cause people always told me I couldn't have that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you can't have that and be an Aiden. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you gonna be selling drugs if you do. Mm. No, I could just have about four or five jobs mm-hmm. and just say, you know what? The same amount of time I used to put in back in the day and selling drugs, yeah. I'm gonna take that same time and work. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, and actually work. Respect. Get money for it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, like, it. do that. And then you'll... Then you could buy foreign cars and all that and you ain't gotta worry about nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, all this legit. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, when I could win in the drug game when I was in back in the day, you know what I'm saying? And actually like had pounds and all types of stuff and living how I'm living now and go to prison and all that stuff, come out, have my grandma die in my arms and all that stuff and go straight legit from there and started with nothing. Yeah. And gained everything. And all I had to do is go to work. Respect. Go to work and go to school. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is, bro. Because let, let everybody know where they can find you on social media, bro. Oh, you already know. It's your boy, <laughs> Lakin Spady. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's L- on Facebook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Facebook. Spell you know it what out. Saying? Spell it out for me. L A K E N N S P A D Y. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? I always put my real name on everything because right. at the end of the day, I ain't stunting or hiding or being fake for nobody. Respect. You know what I'm saying? So. I always make sure, because I actually travel, you know what I'm saying? Like, I be everywhere, you right. know what I'm saying? Like, not just in my city. I could be in my city today, and I could be maybe in New York or 
drive to Florida or fly to Florida the next day. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. But I'm a working man. I work every day, so I go wherever the money goes mm. because that because that's what rule the world. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like if that's you ain't right. if you ain't got no money, how can you, how how can you stand on anything? Really or know. or how do your opinion matter? That's why in some type of instant, I, I kind of do. I respect Trump. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Not not saying I like him. Yeah. I respect him because he like. He, he just like me if I was president. <laughs> I want to give a fuck of how a motherfucker feels. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do me. Yeah, yeah. Like, as worse as as much a racist he could have been, that man gave you more money than any other, any I other president. My, I that, was that, just that, telling that, my that boy did. yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Before, I was like, everybody getting money on the Trump, bro. Just, that's what I'm this saying. This can't say they ain't getting money on like, the Trump, bro. This you can't hate, say that. You hate, you hate Trump. <laughs> but this man putting thousands and thousands of dollars in black people pockets. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? From the system. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? When at the end of the day, if he really was a racist as most people really think that he is, he could have been like, fuck y'all. Mm -hmm. The fuck, my fat, now y'all about to kill each other. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> what? I'm, a, I'm like, I'm being honest. No, like, that, and motherfuckers right. really don't think like that. Nah, that's just right. like with the whole, you trying to burn down Skylight. Yeah. You're going to burn down Skylight. Understand, they already. Is the only reason why this city, this this town, get any type of business or anything really? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Underst and also understand, majority of the fire department and EMS work there. Mm. So when you burn they shit down, and they ain't even clans no more, mm -hmm. you gonna wake up the real clans. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you gonna wake up the real one. Send all them motherfuckers down here, and and, and what's and where they gonna start off with first? Little old eight, mm. the projects, the same hood I grew up in. Mm. You know what I'm saying? All y'all might make it out of the hood, but your loved ones are still in the hood. Mm. But y'all wouldn't care if they died though. But you love them though. Nah, 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 nah. I, I foreseen all that shit. No, 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 no. We ain't about to have that shit. You know what I'm saying? And then when they come burning shit down and all that, who y'all want to call? The same people who shit y'all burnt down mm. to come save y'all or come put the fire out? Y'all motherfuckers stupid, and I ain't even I ain't had to go to college for that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that's just common sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But people want to think as they just capping though. Anybody gonna burn that shit no, down, man? Oh no, yeah. I know they won't. But yeah. my thing is, like, stop thinking as a nigga mm. and just be black. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. I don't care if my girl white. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, hell, I would have been with the black girls, but all the ones I had, except for maybe three. Won't shit. <laughs> oh, ratchet as fuck. <laughs> like, I'm a type of person, I'm not going to take you into a mall summer and I do something you don't like. <laughs> oh, hell no. Bitch. That ain't all black toys, though, man. Huh? Hell, I no, can't let you no, do that. No, 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 no. That I'm, ain't all of them. No, it's, I'm not just saying black people, yeah, yeah, yeah. but I'm just saying yeah, people yeah. like that, period. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Because yeah, yeah. I'm a type of person. I done sat at a table full with millionaires mm -hmm. or hundreds and thousandaires mm -hmm. and me not be nowhere near. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And they still respect me as if I was one of them because they see the mind level that I'm trying to be on. They know I would actually go out there and work for it. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a type of person, like, I'm a businessman. You know what I'm saying? So, if it's, you want to handle business or you want me to come work for you or this, that, and third, like, show me the money. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. am I ever... Yeah, like... Hey, man, it's been an interesting convo, bro. You oh, yeah, know what appreciate I'm saying? it, appreciate It's it. definitely going to go up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, man, you uh, definitely answered a lot of my, a lot of this stuff I had questions for, bro. Uh, oh, yeah. We definitely got to And that's why I be telling people, like, if people actually really sat down and talked to me... Yeah. They will understand. Well, I mean, for the most part, everybody know you, though. Like, and, the, exactly. the people that was just arguing yeah. with you, they know you, yeah. so... Yeah, and, that and that's my thing. Nah, like, yeah. yeah. A lot of people... Just want entertainment on Facebook. It's internet, just like, man. like, just yeah. try to get known. My thing is this: Is you getting known for the right reasons, or are you getting known for the wrong reasons? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, is you getting known because you're hating on somebody, mm -hmm. and you getting known off their hate, or is you getting known because you actually out there busting your ass and getting on? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like. Hey man, for those that are watching, make sure you subscribe to the Yerk TV 252 page. That's Yerk TV 252 on all social media platforms as well. Make sure you follow Lakin Spady, man, and his journey. 
as he as he as he uh, rallies to be the king of eighty, man. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just fucking with my boy, but respect. Now I appreciate you, man, for fucking with me, man. Oh, you know no doubt, I mean? man. All love, yeah. all love. That's I love seeing black people doing good. That's a fact. Me too, man. Yerk. She doing quasi shit. Huh. Work, work, working on my bank roll. Trying to flip it cause I'm tired of the same mode. Getting richer on these niggas, that's my main goal. That's my main goal. Shit. Huh. What you doing, Kelly? Stacking, trying to lay low. My amigo say I'm at them brand new level. Know the devil trying to get my ass a halo. Hey. This the type of.